Hey everyone, welcome back to Food Prep Inc. Today we're gonna to be preparing this Marie Callender's Easy Prep Ready to Bake Dutch Apple Pie. We've got everything that we need assembled here. It's quite simple. You just need your pie. You need a baking sheet. I've covered mine with foil because fruit pies do tend to leak out a little bit. That way it's easy to clean up. And some scissors to open everything up. First thing you need to do is preheat your oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit, and then we're just gonna get everything opened up. So we have here our crumb topping. We're gonna sit this aside on the counter and just let it sit there while the pie bakes. Now we're gonna open up our pie, get all of this wrapper off. All right, we've got our pie out here. We're just gonna go ahead and sit that on our baking sheet. And we need to put this into the oven for their recommendation is 60 to 65 minutes. And once it comes out, that's when we're gonna add our crumb topping to it. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, everyone, it has been 65 minutes. My pie is out of the oven and we've got our crumb topping here. And we're just gonna go ahead and kind of separate this out while it is in the package. All right, now that we've got that done, I'm just gonna cut off kind of the, a large section of the corner, and then we're gonna start to sprinkle this all the way over the top of our pie. We're gonna start at the outer edge and work our way toward the inside, and then it says to use a fork to kind of distribute it evenly once you have it on there. So that's what we're gonna do. All right, that's very haphazard, but the fork is gonna save the day. We're just gonna go ahead and just kind of tamp this down very lightly. You don't wanna pack it down, but we're just gonna distribute it and break up some of the larger chunks that were on there. All right, now that is done. We are going to pop our pie back into the oven for about 10 minutes until the top crumbly part is a nice golden brown. All right guys, our pie has just come out of the oven. I did go ahead and leave mine in for 13 minutes. At 10 minutes, it looked fine, but I did want just a little bit more color on my crumb. So I think now it has turned out great. This is our completed pie. It was very simple to make. If you guys would like to know how this tastes, definitely check out our other channel, Five Minute Eats, where we're gonna give you a full review and let you know if we would purchase this again or not. But in the meantime, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and we'll catch you next time. Bye. All right guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Five Minute Eats. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.